Minister Maru stated that the special economic zones will host local investments before allowing international ones to come in. But let me also make it clear, we are not only talking about foreign investors, we are talking about local investors as well. In fact, they will be given priority. And please, believe me, they should also invest in these exciting opportunities. For example, the Paga Hill Hotel up there, we are looking at up to 40% to be owned by Papua New Guinea investors. Maru also stated that the 800 billion Kina Paga Hill project is a special economic zone and he is pushing for 40% of its investments to be strictly local. Minister Maru also stressed further on local investment in the Vanimo free trade zone. And even if there's a free trade zone in Vanimo, we will insist that many of the investors must be locals. Let companies, our own people, we must create vehicles using the stock exchange to create vehicles, public investment vehicles for us to raise cheap revenue and for our own people to own this. Because this will be a tax holiday forever. So why can't Papua New Guinea have the first bite of the cherry? And this has to be given, privilege has to be given to our local people. Minister Maru stressed that he is pushing for local investments to be recognized in other projects going forward. Francisca Anania, National MTV News.